So greetings everyone, my name is Ronan Lynch, also known as Jasil. Uh, the reggae movement has been pretty much on the cutting edge of technology as far as music goes. From the times of the 60s and 70s in the Jamaican studios when you had people like King Toby actually building uh, the first units by themselves. So that's one of the things that we've been trying to show to people a little bit, is the evolution of the sound system, how it comes about. The UK Steppers movement was a quite crucial movement, and along with that, the UK sounds of the early 90s were some of the first sounds to start to travel outside of the UK. They were the ones that really planted the seed. The evolution of dub music, the special mixes, the engineer as a musician and not just as somebody outside the project. We're interested in looking at especially things that are technologically interesting and where there's, where there's progress. The thing that defines reggae music a lot really is the bass. How should we say vibrations in the music? Vibrations in the music. Vibrations in the music. When you put a reggae record on a sound system, you're going to get the full spectrum of the movement because the people producing the music are thinking about it. staying on the cutting edge of this and looking on how people build up together as a community. exhibition we're going to take on the road this summer both to some festivals and also hopefully to some smaller towns and venues to show people the extent that reggae has evolved and moved over the last 20 years. So I hope you enjoy that.